Hey folks, Ronald here. So last week I showed you how to hook up your MacBook Pro M1 to two monitors because by default it doesn't support that. Um, but it's not perfect. I discovered a couple of uh, bugs and actually with the Mac Mini, uh, that bug also happens and I'm gonna show you both and some workarounds in this video. I'm down here with my MacBook Pro. Upstairs is the Mac Mini, both of them M1s. And I wanna show you and talk to you about a couple of uh, issues that I discovered. One of them is actually not even related to the monitor, but with the mouse, for some reason, and this applies to both computers, but after you boot up, sometimes the mouse gets disabled for like five or 10 seconds and then re-enables. I'm not really sure why that is maybe the drivers for the mouse is not uh, m1 native i don't know i'm not sure but it, let me know in the comments if you ran into that also because it's happening on both my computers um but the other issue the more annoying one is when the monitors go to sleep and i'm gonna put the this computer to sleep right now and ideally it'll happen because it doesn't happen all the time, but most of the times down here for the Mac Mini, for the MacBook Pro. When I wake it up, it'll only wake up one of them. It's like the computer's got a little personality. It's like, I think I'll just work with one monitor. That's your problem if you can't deal with that. Got a sassy computer. I never liked that word sassy. All right, so I'm gonna try to wake it up. There it is on the laptop. And watch, this one wakes up. And, and that's, that's how it stays, you see that? The second monitor, can you see that? Second monitor's remaining black. Now, last time I was toying around with this, if I turned this off and turned it back on, it would work. But then one time it didn't. And then I actually did something else which is unplug it from the back and plug it back in and it worked. Which is annoying. It's like, ugh, why do I have to do that? See, look at that. So it, it went black. Now, if I unplug it from the back, plug it back in, does that do it? And that seemed to have done it. It's gonna stay on and it stays on. Ah! Ah! That's so stupid! <laughs> ah! I mean, technically, we're using a workaround, so it's possible that's not completely perfect. And now, if I shut the computer to go into clamshell mode, it should be okay, come on, don't, don't die on me, don't die. Look at that, it went off. You see that, that's so annoying. Okay, I'm gonna reboot it. Or actually before I, if I let's see if I don't, I'm not, I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna reboot it. I'm gonna unplug it back here and plug it in again. And that did it. <sighs> ah! All right, so I guess a hack workaround, I, I don't like hacks, but would be to just set your computer so that it doesn't go to sleep so soon or disable the sleep. That's probably the easiest, you know. Um, either that, you could unplug it and replug it. Now the thing is that I have these two Asus monitors. I don't know if it's specific to my monitor. Probably not. It probably happens on any monitor. But let me know if you're experiencing this. But you know what? The computer's still pretty fast and quiet. I mean, this is like a minor nuisance. If I have to disable the sleep, 
I'm fine with that. I'm still happy with the computer overall. Um, yeah. Okay, so let me go ahead and show you what the issue is with the Mac Mini upstairs. Okay, so I'm gonna demonstrate how we have an issue with the Mini, with the, with the monitors, okay? So check this out. We got the two screens up, um, Premiere on one and uh, uh, Barbara Streisand on the other. You guys like Barbara Streisand? I F with Barbara Streisand. I like her. When I was a kid, I would like not show my friends that I like that kind of music, you know, as part of my repertoire. I'd be like, oh no, they're gonna judge me. But you know, music doesn't define the man that you are. True men know how to be confident and acquire all type of music. Now maybe if I was dancing in my house, half naked listening to her, then maybe that'd be a little weird, but that's, that's not the case. All right, so the computer's going to sleep, and watch what happens when I wake it up. One monitor. So here's the thing, with the Mac Mini, on the back, there, there's the HDMI port that I'm using, and then there's the USB-C um, port that I'm also using. However, this issue happens when I have another USB-C port occupied with this dongle. I'll show you, um, I'll put a, a picture of the, the dongle that, I, that I'm using. But when that dongle is not attached, then I can use both monitors and it doesn't go to sleep. Like right now, if I were to reboot it, then they will both come up. So this is how we fix it though. Okay, so back here is the dongle. Now, if I take this cable out of the USB-C in the back of the Mac Mini that's attached to the dongle. So what I do is I have this little adapter, USB-C to USB, and I use this to plug into the USB B port in the back of my Mac Mini instead of the USB-C. And so now uh, both monitors are working because it's just using the HDMI and one USB-C that it can use to detect the other monitor, okay? So those two were already there, but for some reason activating the second USB-C with this dongle, it screws it up. But if I plug in something else into this USB-C, like an external hard drive, it doesn't mess it up. And as it stands like this, it works like 98% of the times. I think it only screwed up on me once. Okay, so now you see both monitors working, right? Let me go ahead and put it to sleep again. And this is gonna be the moment of truth, the test. And let's try to wake it up. And both of them wake up, myself and Barbara. So if this annoys you, I mean, this is pretty good. I, I don't have an issue uh, with this, but if this annoys you, I guess the other alternative would be to just get one of those ultra widescreen monitors and then you just have one monitor getting plugged into the Mac Mini, all right? So there, so if you like this video, please go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Um, and to learn more about uh, situations like this and see other videos of mine, uh, definitely subscribe. And I will see you in the next video.